My name is Susan Pomerantz. I'm a former government intelligence analyst who became a practicing psychologist working in Manhattan. It was a big transition. There have been a few of them. In 1986, I was diagnosed with retinitis pigmentosa, a genetic progressive eye disease. As the disease began to progress, I was studying to get my PhD in psychology, and then I continued to lose more and more of my sight. Then I lost my independence. I stopped leaving my house except to go to work. I stopped hanging out with friends. I had to learn to do everything a lot differently. I had to adjust to my new life. And that's when I met Logan. I graduated from the Seeing Eye in October 2014 a nonprofit that breeds, raises, and trains seeing eye dogs. Meeting Logan there changed my life. As soon as I put my hand on him, I was in love. Growing up near New York City, getting around, it was always partly exciting and a lot of times frustrating. That hasn't actually changed much. I notice the smells more. I notice the sounds more. I notice bumps, touches, and grazes of people passing me more. It's actually more often Logan and me passing them because he is such a speed demon, and I'm always rushing to catch a train. It's actually not a bad commute. Logan and I really love this walk. He starts wagging his tail as soon as we hit the first step out of the subway. I can feel his tail wagging. Logan's amazing. I'm so secure about moving around New York City with just Logan because when I was in training at the Seeing Eye, the instructor brought Logan and me into the city and I saw immediately that Logan was on top of it, that he was gonna keep me safe and Logan is my eyes looking out for me. Logan is a huge part of my work day. I'm a psychologist, so it's really important that he is well behaved in my office. He doubles as a therapy dog, I think, for my patients. I have to take breaks because I have to take him out and get him some exercise. I'm basically free to do anything I want now because I don't have to worry, I don't have fear, and now I'm free to live my life. Something I can do now that I couldn't do before is go to new places on my own. Now Logan just guides me, and that's something I, I wasn't really comfortable doing before. I like to hit a Starbucks and then a bodega for lunch and take it to the park so Logan and I can get outside and get some exercise. If the weather's nice, we might go for a quiet lunch. And then the yoga studio afterwards. And then he takes me home in the evening. Logan really is an extension of me and allows me to do all the things I did and still want to do. We love working together. We love playing together. We love being together. I am Susan and this is Logan. And we are an extraordinary team.